All right, what is up, guys? We are back at the uh, the locks. This is the place I found two fishing poles and some other stuff. So I'm gonna try here again. It's, it's always good to go to some of the same fishing spots a couple times because magnet fishing is like battleship. You know, you might throw something right next to something really good, and you don't actually get it, and you'll never know because you can't see anything. It's just luck of the draw. So. It's good to come back a couple different times, so that way maybe you'll get something that you missed the previous time. Um, so I'm going to get the gear ready and we're going to get straight into it. Okay guys, so we're geared up and I'm going to try something different. We're going to try out this right here. So what I've done is <clears throat> I've attached the GoPro to the rope to try to get a rope view, rope cam if you will. I got a secondary line tied to my GoPro in case something happened and this thing just fails and fell off, I can still recover my GoPro. So, refocus. Basically, if there's something down there, we might be able to see the magnet actually grab it, which might be pretty cool. Or when we review the footage, we might see something else under there and be like, oh my God, I have to go back, there's a gun right there. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> so we're gonna try this. It might be stupid, it might be great. I don't know. Let's try it out. Okay, so hopefully that footage turned out good. We'll find out, I guess, in this video. But uh, I took it off because, man, I'm super, I'm super scared to lose my GoPro. It's my only GoPro. It's scary. I didn't want to get like stuck at the side of the wall or break it off or something. So I took it off, put it back on the chest, the chest mount. I'm gonna go down here because I found a path and it goes down to these little rocks down here. And I'm gonna try maybe a double-sided magnet because I definitely did not throw my magnet out that way. So. It looks like people have been going down there and fishing, so there's a possibility to find something there. So let's go do that. Okay, guys. I forgot to grab the double sided magnet, but we're gonna go over here. Look at all this trash in my life. People are the worst. Navigate through the trees. Oh, oh look at that. Hey guys, oh, found a bobber. Okay, just gonna sit you there. And then get my rope to cooperate. Okie dokie now. Let's see if we can find some trash. Boom! Oh! Oh, a whole bunch of rocks right here. Oh, 
Well, that felt magnetic, though, whatever that was, but it broke off. Try to go to a little bit of a higher spot. Is that a vial? Is that a blood vial? What the? <laughs> Bro, I feel like it looks like a blood vial. And there's liquid inside. That's that's kind of weird. We're gonna move that over there. Uh, yeah, that's super sketch. Ooh. Yeah, I should have grabbed the double-sided because all these rocks are just flipping the magnet. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm just gonna go back up top and try my luck because it's easier to pull straight up with this magnet. Okay, dokie, here we go. Stuck on fit. Uh, we're stuck on finish line. See the water. Oh, what was that? What was that? Oh, there was something right there, guys. They let go. Let's try to go back straight out again. Fishing line. some bits of stuff on there like that's a piece of a hook another piece of a hook <sighs> if we just drag it line or we got something it's fishing line ah oh shoot ah no here we go with this again <sighs> really reason 6,000 that I probably should not have come back to this location but it's cool.
Alright guys, I think I'm going to call it quits, uh, it's just getting real cloudy, we don't have much daylight anymore these days, I got other things I need to do. Today wasn't really exciting and I'm, that sucks, I'm sorry, but you know, not all adventures are going to be bangers. So, you know, I think the most exciting thing we found was that weird, like, vial of blood. I don't know why that's here, that's, ah, it's weird and gross, I don't like it. But, uh, I didn't really want to, but I went back and I got my, like, thicker, kind of industrial, chemical proof, all that jazz gloves that I bought for magnet fishing that I really don't don't like for magnet fishing now, but I went over and I picked it up and I threw it away just in case somebody's kid goes over there or just another adult might touch it and get some kind of weird medieval disease or something. Swine flu, bubonic plague, HIV type stuff in there, I don't know. That's creepy. But uh, yeah, so, Again, I'm sorry this video wasn't the most exciting video. Hopefully they're gonna get better for you guys. I'm just trying to share my adventures with you and have some fun along the way. So if you wanna to continue to support that, you should click the subscribe button, hit that bell notification so you know every time I upload a video. And you should like this video, even though it's not a great video at all, but you should still like it, it helps me out. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go home, I got some things to do, I gotta get cleaned up, but uh, hope you guys are having a good one. And I will see you next time. Peace.